There are many asking for the opportunity to come in to the Hiddus room of the Friedrich Rebbe. But for many reasons, we don't have the ability to permit people to come in here to visit this room. Look over the Tavis, at least we want to give the opportunity for pe to people to be able to see the room and all the details in it as it was those 10 years that the Friedrich Rebbe was here in this room, Tavshin till Tavshin Yud, and so it is till today without a change. Let us start with the table and the chair that the Friedrich Rebbe was sitting on. We see that near the chair there is a little swinging sh sh uh, bookcase that the Rebbe would hold his Sforim while he was learning. He should be able to have some sperm near him. On the table we see the bell when he needed help to call his secretary or to one of the family. He would press on the bell and they would come in. We also see on the table the pad on which he was writing all the thousands of letters and my morim and sikhs. We see the clock, the original clock that was standing on the table that he was using. We see the light on the table. We see here on the side a chair that when Choshevi would come in for Yechidas, they would sit on the chair. Chesidim would usually stand, they wouldn't have to use this chair. And we we'll see the room full with bookcases from the floor till the ceiling, all around the room. The only exception is where there are windows, but even there, there are bookcases in top of the window and bookcases on the bottom of the window. But it is hard to go up always to take this forum from the top. So there was a little step ladder that was used to take down this forum from the top shelves. On this step ladder, we also saw in the picture, the last picture of the Rebbe, lighting Hanukkah candles at this entrance of this room. So the Hanukkah candle, the Meneiras Hanukkah, was standing in top of this step ladder. In the last years, it was hard for him to walk. So there was always a wheelchair in the room that he, if they he had to go somewhere, they would take him on this wheelchair. In back of this we see a closet, door to the wall closet, where we would hold his more valuable holy items. We see on the side a door 
It used to be a window and they built a door when they built for this home the porch. There was also the suke. We see the main entrance, the door to this room, and the little corridor where you come in from the door from outside to the corridor and from the corridor to the Achilles room. Against this door we see another door that goes to the bedroom. And there is another one door that we see in the middle of the room that goes to next room. In the early years, Tovshin till Tovshin base, it was the room for the Rebbe's mother, Rebbe'sn uh, sorry, the Rebbe'sn of the Rebbe Rashab. After his, her passing, and Yud Gimel Shvat, Tov Shin Beis, that became the room like a little shul where there was a minion dining Shabbos. The Rebbe, the Friedrich Rebbe, would be sitting with a little open, this door a little open, and he would participate in the dining and listening to Kresha Tere with a minion that was in the room behind this door. On this table, on this corner, we have the video, the famous video of Tafshin Tess, where when the judges came to sign the Rebbe on his citizen papers, so they were standing on this side of the table. The Friedrich Rebbe was sitting on this chair and the Rebbe was standing near him to show him where he should sign. In the middle of the room we also have under the bookcases we see this suitcase in which the Friedrich Rebbe was holding the most holy items, like the Siddur of the Baal Shem Tov, the Kisviyat Kedesh of, the, of his father, the memoriam of his father, and many other Kisviyat Kedesh of the Rebbe. As we remember to hear and read that under the Nazi occupation, where he was in Warsaw, where bombs shell fell all around. He would never move from this suitcase. That somewhere, some, if he had to walk somewhere, someone would go with him, holding this suitcase with the holiest, holiest items in the collection. So, this is the room where you could at least see the pictures of it, the video of it, as it was, never changed anything of how it was in the period of the Friedrich Rebbe, Tovshin till Tovshin Yudu.